Yeah. Hey guys, here's some tips to help you with your Wing Chun side board. So, from the Kim Yong Ma, when I switch 90 degrees to the side, my weight should be shifted onto my hind leg and my back is straight. Now the knee on the front leg should be bent. Don't lock it out or else that's dangerous. Another thing is the toes should be pointed parallel 45 degrees outwards. So if I'm stepping into my opponent, if my toes open, any foot that comes in, my groin area is quite vulnerable. So you want to close it. It's the same thing as the Kim Yong Ma on the front side. We want to make sure we can close this ball. Okay? Now, a good way to train the side horse instead of just walking, we could also practice our kicks. If my weight's all the way on the back and my back is straight, I should be able to lift my leg without moving my body. You could do the bong grip with the bong south. Yeah. Deep. Stop. And the other side. Yeah. Deep. Stop. You could even add the kick, like the wang chang grip. Yeah. Deep. And see, my head does not go up when I kick. Okay, you can even do the ding grip. Yeah. Deep. Stop. And you can add this into the walk as well. If I'm doing the K-walk and forward, I could do the time, right? K-walk, time. K-walk, time. Time. Okay? 